We got a 2014 Forester in the shop today. Customers complaining of a growling noise on the highway. I test drove it. It's very light, but I think it's coming from the back right. So we're going to put it up and test it real quick and see if it's that. So one way to find a worn wheel bearing is to hold on to the coiled spring and spin the wheel and usually the vibration will transfer into the coil spring and if it's completely smooth then it's something else or it's a different wheel. So I put these bolts in the back plate just to hold the back plate on because nothing's holding it on except for this uh, e-brake cable. If I remove those bolts, this thing's just gonna fall to the floor. What's he doing? What are you doing? See? So just waiting on a new part. As soon as I get there, I'm gonna install it. I hit the surface here with the Scotch-Brite pad just to make installation a little bit easier and it just slid right in. A new part came in. It's OEM unit. So, store this in.
There's a new one installed. It's a pretty easy job because the whole thing comes out, you change the entire hub. Important that you knock this little guy right here in after you tighten the nut. Just got to put the brake disc on and put the caliper on and test drive this thing. Pump the brakes a couple times. Make sure that that those pads are seating against that rotor. Now I gotta maneuver my way out of this. Oh, it's always challenging working in such close quarters to all these other cars. Looks like all clear. Alright, well I know it's probably impossible for you to hear, but the noise is gone from the back right. It was this like real slight droning noise that came on around like 40 and hung around up until I got up to 65. But I don't hear it anymore, so this one's fixed. So thanks for watching.